About a week ago, I went out and bought the new Nintendo Switch Lite in blue. I haven't had time to unbox it ever since, as my schedule didn't really have any open spots for me to do it, but here I am, ready to unbox the new Switch Lite. Now I already have a Switch Lite in turquoise and then the normal Switch, so this was probably an unnecessary purchase for a lot of people, but it was blue so I'm consoling myself with that. <laughs> Anyways, I had been eyeing it ever since they announced it. The color looks amazing. It's one of my favorite shades. So let's just get right into it. I will switch the camera view so that you guys can see it all. So let's do that. So this is what the box to the new blue Nintendo Switch Lite looks like. It looks just like all the other boxes, which I will show you. So now let's just get into the box itself. So here's the Nintendo Switch in the new blue color. So this is what it looks like and to me it looks, it really does look like a mix between blue and purple in a way, but it does seem to be more blue than purple. It is so pretty. This is such a pretty color for the Switch. Had they released this instead of the turquoise, and the turquoise would have been released like now, for example, I don't know if I would have gotten the turquoise because this one is seriously so pretty and I think I would have been satisfied. I think the color of it is the reason I really wanted it. I still can't get over this color. It really is such a pretty shade. So really quickly, I just put my fingers on it. I hope it doesn't show too much. I'm just gonna put the switch right here and go through the rest of the box with you guys. So in here, there's the paperwork and then there's the charger, which I think I'm gonna leave in here because I am using my other charger for my other Switch Lite, so I don't need this one currently. And like I did mention at the beginning of this video, I did get a couple of accessories for the new Switch because I needed a case to make sure that it was protected and then I wanted to put some screen protectors, so that is just what I did. I got some Orsley Switch Lite Premium Tempered Glass. It says it's a lifetime pack, but since I have two Nintendo Switch Lights, I might not be a lifetime pack for me, but for somebody who only has one Switch Lite and only plans on having one Switch Lite, this is definitely recommended. Next up, I did buy a case because like I did mention, I only had one for my other Switch Lite and that was it. So I got the Snorlax pouch. Um, also, there was a massive sticker here that I just took off and then it left this kind of like glue residue. So I just put some blue tape over it because it was getting some dog hair and dust and dirt all on it and I didn't want that in the video. So that is why there's blue tape right here. So now I'll show you guys what the case actually looks like. So this is the Snorlax case. I thought it would look really good with the Switch Lite, so as soon as I purchased it, I purchased this case. So I have been anxiously waiting for its arrival and it did just a couple days ago. So I'm excited to show you guys all of it put together. So there's five game slots and then the inside fits a switch pretty comfortably. I did get the switch light size because 
I didn't need more cases that would fit my normal switch. That's how I'm gonna call it. <laughs> but this is what it looks like with the switch inside. So there is quite enough room for the switch light to fit in and be all nice and cozy in. So now I'm just gonna take out a screen protector and put it on the switch. I've already gotten it dirty with my fingerprints, so I am gonna have to clean that. So after a lot of hard work, this is what it looks like. It is still not perfect though. Unfortunately, in my house, there's so much dust and dog hair that it's pretty difficult to get something like this perfect. But I will try again later, although it doesn't look too bad. And now I'll just be putting it back inside the pouch. And with that, that is all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I certainly did. This color is amazing. It is definitely my favorite by far for the Nintendo Switch Lite color collection. Like I said before, had this come out before the turquoise, I would have just gotten this one and would have been totally fine with it. It just looks so good with the blue and the white buttons. It just, it looks so good and I am so excited. I'm also really happy with the choice of case I made. I feel like it looks super well together, so I'm also super happy about that. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya!